<clears throat> Hello there, Raul. This is Christian down here in Santiago, Chile. Yes, down here in the, at the bottom of the continent here in South America. Um, I'm doing a video entry to your contest. First of all, congratulations on achieving 100 uh, subscribers. You are a new channel to me. I discovered it uh, by, uh, I think, Brendan Bandy from Australia who did a video entry to your contest. You ask uh, to show a uh, uh, five um, five bands, five albums from one type of, of, of genre, uh, and maybe show it, if we show ten, we have two entries. So you ask to show um, five according to one uh, sub genre of a style of, of music. The the kind of music that I like it's it's heavy metal, hard rock, uh, thrash, uh, power metal, glam, and uh, 80s uh, hard rock from the LA scene. That I think it's one of my favorites. So I'm going to go with 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 that. Here I have a a bunch of of, uh, of records and some some cassettes to show, and I'm going to go with um, hard rock. I think it's one of my favorites. It's one of my the thing. The, the, I think it's one of the best genres here in in the in, in rock music. Um, so without further ado, I'm going to go with some from the 80s. That's the, that's the decade that I was uh, introduced uh, to music uh, back in the day in the mid 80s uh, with all the the bands that were coming from the LA scene, uh, Sunset Strips, Sunset Strip, and all those uh, other places like the Whiskey Go Go. Um, the rainbow and all that stuff. So without further ado, I'm going to go and start with um, one, of, one of my favorites and it's a uh, rat and this is their, their first, uh, their not technical, technically it's not their debut but it's their first major release. Uh, first they had a, an EP, of course uh, the, the rat EP but this is their, their debut on, on a, with a, with a full-length album it's out of the cellar with the many famous songs like uh, Wanted Man and of course Round and Round it was a huge uh, video back in the day on MTV uh, Handbanker's Ball and on every um, other network that was uh, showing some uh, hard rock music so there it is uh, Rat and Round and Round next we have um, the other big one Motley Crue and this is the third out no one two three yes no fourth Sorry, fourth album. It's uh, Girls, 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 of course, with that uh, song Girls, Girls, Girls and Wild Side. Um, it's a good one. Not as not as good as um, Dr. Feelgood or, of course, that, um, of, as um, ah, Too Fast for Love and, and the. Oh, sorry, I've forgotten the, the, the other one. Of, uh, Shout out devil, brain fart. So this is uh, Motley Crue with, uh, with with their fourth album, Girls, Girls, Girls. So there we have second band. Next we have um, a band from Sacramento, California, from the late eighties. This is a um, sec uh, second, second, yes. This is their second album from eighty. 85, 87, 88. This is 88. This is Tesla and the, the Great Radio Controversy. This is an album that they, that it was very big in back in the day because they had some big songs like uh, Love Song. That's a, a big one and um, really really good ones. They were put together and they were put in the bag of the LA LA bands with um, more of the glam glam sound but they are a little bit uh, more blues here more more hard rock more uh, heavy if you if compared to like uh, I don't know poison or warrant uh, or even um, or even motley but this is a, a good one so please give it a try and you won't be disappointed so there we have it third album uh, Tesla and the great radio controversy next we have uh, another band from that uh, mostly from the end of, of the 80s and this is the uh, third album uh, but this is their second on a major label and it's uh, White Lion and Big Game 
We have uh, two big uh, music figures like uh, Mike Trump, there we have it, and of course Vito, Vito Brata, great, um, great uh, guitar player, and here we have James Romeso who, who uh, played in a couple of records with uh, Megadeth after they, they broke, kind of broke up with Megadeth, he must say, um, put, put the, the band back together when he was uh, healed from some, some kind of injury he had on his uh, arm and, uh, and he re recruited um, James Romenso as ba bass player instead of uh, David Ellefson. This is a good one. Uh, some uh, big songs like um, Little Fighter and uh, Raider Love, they, they do a cover of the uh, Golden Earring uh, song, there it is. So there you have it, uh, album number four, White Lion and Big Game. Next, uh, some classics, the big album from White Snake, um, their, their self-titled self album. This is a uh, present from down here in down here from a, a neighbor country, this is an Argentinian present, so that's why they put uh, 1987, because the original album does not have this one, it's just like this, so they put it 1987, a big, big album, uh, Still of the Night, of course, that's the, the big song from this one, but uh, great songs like uh, Bad Boys, Crying in the Rain, Here I Go Again, Is This Love, awesome, awesome album. Uh, it sold, it have sell, sold uh, millions and millions of, of copies. So if you like a kind of blues hard rock uh, with a little bit of glam, you can go wrong with um, White Snake and the self-titled album from 1987. Uh, so there you have one, two, three, four, five. So uh, here are another some more uh, albums from this. Uh, style of this style of music um, from the late 70s early 80s um, a band that started um, back in in those days in germany of course it's the scorpions and the album animal magnetism great one also uh, big songs the big song here is of course uh, the zoo a great one of course, with that solo made by the talk box, by the guitar, uh, that uh, Matthias Japs does it. Really good songs, uh, not, don't make promises your heart can keep. Uh, uh, 21st, uh, not 20th century man. Great album, uh, not as good as um, Blackout or the one that came in before, after this uh, Love at First Thing, but still a good one. If you like uh, early scorpions from the 80s, you can go wrong with animal magnetism. So here it is. Next we have uh, three cassettes uh, that I have here. Also from the 80s. Uh, the, one of the big ones from Twisted Sisters, uh, Under the Blade. As you can see, this is a... Uh, this is a present, sorry about the glare, from, from, from Chile because it has all the, the song titles in, in Spanish, but it's, it's a good one, of course. I never grew up, Destructor, What You Don't Know uh, might, uh, might Hurt You, uh, and of course Under the Blade. So there it is, Twisted Sister. Next we have uh, the, one, of the, one of my favorites from this band. Also, uh, this is Dokken, Tooth and Nail. As you can see again, uh, everything is in Spanish. Um, Alone again, of course, it's it's the big it's the big song in this album. Great one. Cassette from back in the day of uh, I think it is 1985. So there it is. Another one. Um, Crocus change of address. This is a more softer um, uh, uh, album from them because they had uh, the, the, the ones that they had before. Uh, um, Headhunter, it's a big one with uh, some big glass uh, drums, really good one. But this is also a nice one from, um, from the Swiss band. In this one, have uh, Schoolhouse and 
burning up the night. This is a, a, a really, a really good one from the um, Crocus, uh, the, the biggest band from um, from Switzerland. So do you have one? Do you, oh, we're missing one more. I'm going to go with um, this one. Or maybe that one. Here we have another cassette from uh, Warrant. Yep, the, one, of, one of my guilty pleasures because they are kind of uh, too glam sometimes. But this is a, a really good one. I, I prefer this one um, to our uh, Dirty Water and Stinky Feet, Stinky Filth. Here we have, uh, of course, um, uh, Down Boys, it's the big one, uh, and Heaven. A really good one. So there it is, uh, the debut from Warrant, of course, with the late uh, Johnny Lane on, on, on vocals. He was a, a really good uh, singer. Of course, um, he passed away, he passed uh, because of um, uh, drinking complications uh, at the, I think, uh, late 90s, uh, early 2000s. What, what a shame because he was a really good singer, a really good performer, a really good uh, frontman and I think um, the band was uh, getting a little bit harder with, uh, with, uh, with uh, more records that they were putting out. Uh, I think their third one, uh, Dog Eat Dog, I think it's a really good one, more uh, on a harder edge than this one. But still, you, if, you, if you want some good uh, good old uh, 80s sound, a uh, fine band from those days, you can always uh, check uh, Warrant. So uh, there it is. Uh, those are my 10 picks from your, for your contest. Hope you like them. If you don't know um, any of those bands or those records, maybe you can uh, check them out and you can find out if you like them or not. I think you will enjoy them because it's really good music for having a, a good time, uh, partying with your friends, having some beers on a barbecue or whatever, or rolling down the, or taking a drive in your car and listening to some good old 80s music. So, uh, without further ado, uh, Raul, once again, congratulations on, on achieving 100 subscribers. That's a big uh, milestone for your channel. You're a young guy, I'm an older guy, uh, and I uh, enjoy this kind of music. Hope uh, you can dig on some of those records. And without further ado, I'm saying goodbye. This is Christian down here in Santiago, Chile. Till next time, bye bye.